Let's get to the point, your monthly market report from Sierra Nevada Realtors. I'm Sarah Sharkey, your 2023 president. And I'm Christy Frenquest, also your 2023 president of the new Sierra Nevada Realtors. This month's market report is brought to you by the Northern Nevada Regional MLS, your official MLS home search. We hope you enjoy the changes to your new monthly market report, now expanding into all six counties. And now let's get to the point. Let's take a look at the number of new listings and closed sales in our area. The Carson City area had 31 new listings and 25 closings in the month of December. The median sales price was 545,000, which is a jump of 16.6% .6 from November. Total month supply of inventory increased to 4.5. Properties are going into contract in four days. Carson is looking hot right now. Churchill County saw 15 new listings and 22 closings for December. Their median sales price was $355,500, an 18.3% 8, increase from the prior month. The total month supply decreased significantly to 2.9. Properties are going into contract in just 14 days. Douglas County saw 34 new listings and 34 closings. The median sales price was $557,450, a decrease of 3.9% from November. The months of inventory supply it jumped to five months, the closest to a balanced market that we've seen in quite some time. Douglas Properties took only 10 days to go into contract. Thanks, Christy. Before we get into the other half of the market, let's check in with our very own Bowtie Economist, Elliot Eisenberg. Elliot, are we going to see a recession in 2023? That's a great question, Sarah. And I think we are headed for recession, but I also don't think it much matters. Think of it this way. If a strong economy is a 10, I think if we, if we end up not in a recession, but have a soft landing, the economy would be a five. It would be only a five because interest rates have gone way up. They're gonna get higher and they're gonna stay up there for a while. Conversely, if we end up in a recession, the economy ends up being a four. It's not that bad because the labor market's still strong, household savings levels are still high, and corporate balance sheets are in pretty good shape. The difference is quite small. If we have a recession, unemployment rises by two percentage points from where we are. If we end up with a soft landing, it rises by one. These are not large differences in terms of buyers and sellers. This shouldn't objectively make a difference. Make sure to tell them that. It's important. That's it for now. I look forward to seeing you next month. Thanks, Elliot. Don't forget to sign up for Elliot's blog at econ70.com for his latest on what's happening. And now let's take a look at Lyon, Story, and Washoe counties. Lyon County had 42 listings and 54 closed properties. The median sales price was $1,950, a decrease of 7% from November. We ended December with 4.3 months supply. Properties only took six days to go into contract, showing us that Lyon County has inventory, but it's moving fast. Story County has four new listings added to the market and three properties closed. Currently, five months supply of inventory. Properties were on the market for six days before going under contract. And Washoe County, excluding the area of Incline Village, saw 248 new listings and 335 closed sales in December. The median sales price was 516,422. That's a 6.1% decrease from the month prior. Washoe County is currently at 2.5 months supply of inventory, trending down from the past month. Properties were also on the market for six days before going under contract. Looking at all six counties as a whole, our area saw 5.8% decline in sales price. We continue to see properties moving quickly with an average of only six days on the market. Back to you, Christy. Thanks, Sarah. And that wraps up our To The Point video, now covering six counties. Don't forget to check out our bi-monthly Did You Know video series for the latest on best practices in the industry. As always, if you have any questions or would like more information, contact your local Realtor. A full Realtor roster may be obtained at the snr.realtor website, or just scan the QR code on the screen. We will see you next month for the latest to the point.